Or if I just did the video like this. Okay. See how well this is going already. I had to dress for the occasion. You know, I will forever cherish cherish my Chipotle merch. We got the shirt and the hat. Also, I've never worn this hat with my hair down, so I apologize for my hair. So I worked at Chipotle for a year and two months and it was bad. Actually, just kidding. Actually, just kidding about that. <laughs> um, it is a very good job for a high schooler or a college student. The wage, at least in my state, was $10 an hour, which is fantastic for like someone with no experience. You know what I mean? No experience. You know what I mean? Also, why do jobs want people with experience, but you have to get a job before you have experience? Does that make sense? I don't know. I was very lucky to get hired at Chipotle because I just came there a whole bunch and the general manager saw that I came in a whole bunch and was like, yeah, apply again and we'll get you a job. That was really nice and I am forever grateful for that because it was a really good intro to the workforce. Okay, so pros, the wage is really good. Also, you get free food every time you work and half-priced food every time you don't work. I love their food, I never got tired of it. I've actually eaten twice there, like paid for it after I quit. I know a bunch of my coworkers got tired of the food pretty quickly, but I've always loved Chipotle. You can do so much with it. Another pro is this is very individualized to the location, but I loved my coworkers. All of our humor was on the same plane. We all had a chill time. We were all buddies. There's not a coworker I did not vibe with. Again, it so depends on your location, but I really like that part of the job, and that's another reason why I stuck around it for as long as I did. Okay, that is really all of the pros. Um, <laughs> anyway, so let's talk about bad things. <laughs> this is very individualized to your location as well but my manager my general manager was so whack he was basically a hypocrite so there was no way you could satisfy this man you were bound to do something wrong in his eyes at some point in your job and you would get yelled at for pretty much no reason and he would forget about it later and be like oh my gosh you're the best worker ever he's a very stressed out flamboyant explosive man and he would talk about workers um, behind their backs to other workers. Not great management. Again, at your location, your manager might be amazing. It all depends. Another con. The scheduling is kind of whack. They basically want to put the least amount of people on the schedule for each shift. So pretty much, we're screwed sometimes. <laughs> I worked line, by the way. The line people are the people who put the food in the bowls for you. When there is the longest line of online orders and then the longest line of customers going out the door at the same time and there are only two people working line, it's so stressful. There's just no way you can be fast, accurate, and efficient with only two people and tons of orders and get it all out on time. That was always stressful. Also, the customers would get annoyed at us and it wasn't even our fault, we just, didn't have enough people. That was always stressful for me because it was like each day you didn't know if you were going to be okay with enough people on the schedule or not okay with not enough people. Another thing, if you don't want a fast paced, stressful, have to talk to people <laughs> environment, definitely don't recommend Chipotle because you have to talk to people every day and part of the job is looking happy or whatever. If you can get the prep position at Chipotle, that is the best position. I totally recommend it. You're just in the back chopping veggies all day, talking, listening to music. I never did it, but it looked amazing. Also, my general manager said that he wanted more ladies out on the front because customers respond better to women than the men, which I thought was a really weird comment. This is kind of funny. It's not really a con because you can't really hear it as a worker, but the music? The Chipotle playlist is so goofy. Listen next time you go and eat there, or you go and apply there, or you go and do whatever you <laughs> do at Chipotle because it's like... I can't even describe it. My last con, I only have one more con left, major con. So this could actually be a good or bad thing depending on what you're looking for, but each job at Chipotle, each position at Chipotle is very repetitive. My job was basically like, hi, welcome to Chipotle. What can I get started for you? Brown or white rice, black or pink cheese, guac or lettuce. Thanks, see you later. Yeah, it got old really quick. I think I like variety. You'll learn a lot about yourself in your first job, I've noticed. Oh my gosh, my hair, I can feel it being not cute. Overall, I say go for it. It's a good job. You get the wage, you get the free food, you get the merch, you get the two free cheese, the two free t-shirts and the hat, and you get to be like, I worked at Chipotle. Go for it. Worst case scenario, you can quit in two weeks. Let me make another one before the sun goes down. Bye.